Good day. I'm Eric Tennant. So this would be upgrade three for the do-it-yourself water resistant generator. Basically what I want to do is I want to up the ability of how much solar it is able to take. The Jensen is able to do 350 watts. However, it's a bit limited by the voltage. It's a little hard to keep within specs. So if I add in a second one, this one's ready for 400 has a higher amp hour uh, potential coming out of it. It'll basically allow for me to go up well, to a potential of uh, 750 watts of total solar. But to be able to do this, I need to do a couple of upgrades. So on the back, two incoming ports for it. But unfortunately inside here, I have it all joined together because well, I was only using the one Jensen solar charge controller before. So I'm going to clean up the, that cord, basically take the, the Y and put it into two connections. So each one goes to an individual controller. And then I also need to add this onto the inverter, basically the incoming junction. So I have a place to plug it uh, into. But of course, to add this, I'm gonna need to remove the whole inverter from the thing to be able to get to the uh, lugs. Nice. Now I got two inputs. Now for the inverter.
Nice, now I got three inputs. I got two solar charge controller inputs and one for AC current coming in. And then of course from the outside of the case, I got the two solar charge controllers. So now all I need to do is try to get everything into this box. All three batteries and both solar charge controllers and the AC charge controller. So, yep, good times. And the moment of truth, does the lid shut? Nice. And the moment of truth does the lid shut. <laughs> 